Payong is a rice farmer and also the mayor of a small village on the river Manan. On his way to the fields, he calls out the time and the place of a special meeting. Payong's fields lie next to one of the large irrigation canals. The land is not his. He rents from a landowner, just as he rents a tractor for plowing. Payong isn't content to wait for the rainy season to plant his rice, as other farmers do. He built a water pump. He can plant in February. When the fields are well soaked, the water buffalo is used for wet plowing and harrowing. Hey, hey, good. Hey, hey, hot, hot. Hey, 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 good. Hey, hey. ดูนดูนอ่าอ่ากินข้าวกินปลากันเสร็จแล้วเดี๋ยวจิตก็ไปถอนกล้านะเพลินก็ไปช่วยหาบกล้าใจแล้วก็แม่แถมแม่จันเนี่ยไปดำนาไปนะเอากินได้แล้วครับ the busy seasons 10 helpers work for payong he employs women they work as well as men and are paid half as much This year something new is being tried. The rice plants are being transferred from the seed beds to the rice paddies after only four weeks, earlier than usual. Payong hopes that this will result in better growth and earlier ripening. The temperature is 100 degrees, bearable for the Thai farmer, but not for the water buffalo. After three or four hours of work, the animals must be cooled off and taken back to the village to rest.
ค่ะAfter work in the fields, Payong tends to his duties as mayor, urging the villagers to come to the special meeting. A government expert has come to the village to talk about irrigation. If the farmers irrigate, he tells them, rather than wait each year for the rainy season, they can harvest two crops a year. นอกเหนือไปจากนาหวานของเราธรรมดาพวกเราคงจะเคยได้ยินว่าทางรัฐบาลเนี่ยมีนโยบายอยากจะส่งเสริมการอยู่ดีกินดีเออนี่ถ้
grain is dry, the harvest can begin. Pivin, Pivin, Magyatani. Hey! After the rice is safely harvested, monks are invited to the farm. They pray for Buddha's blessing on the home, the land, and the profitable sale of the grain. A white bread to the monks to a pile of grain. Enclosed is included in the blessing. This is a very great occasion for Payong. However, the monks of Thailand are fed by the people every day, not just on special occasions. The oldest monk blesses the grain. The mother of rice, represented by a straw figure, looks on with favor. The threshing can begin. It will go on for four weeks.
rice is checked for size and quality, then bagged for shipment. Payong's crop came to over 100 sacks of grain. But after his debts are paid, he'll clear about $120, for one quarter of the selling price. <laughs> the grain merchant, like most of the merchants of Thailand, is Chinese. Payong prepares his field for a new sowing. Most of his neighbors are still harvesting. of a long day for the harvesters, but not for Payong. His water wheel works day and night, irrigating the new seed beds. <laughs> 